Hi, my name is Vachay Sapanian with your Glendale Unified School District News for January 25th. Great Kindness Challenge Week is underway until January 29th. This year's theme is Kindness Unites. Students and staff across the district are participating in various projects to participate in this National Week. There will be an informational session that will take place this Wednesday on the new History Social Science textbooks for grade 6 through 12 that Glendale Unified plans to adopt. All parents of students who are in these grades are welcome to attend. Parent Night for Secondary History Social Science will take place on January 27th. It will take place from 4 to 5.30 p.m. And if you haven't registered yet, don't forget the next Parent Academy session is on January 28th. It will highlight internet safety. You register now for this session at www.gosc.net slash parentacademy. You'll also find the February sessions there as well. Glendale Unified students participated in the annual Poetry Out Loud competition virtually this year. Well, welcome everybody to this year's uh, Poetry Out Loud virtual competition. Used to seeing everybody in the uh, GUSD boardroom, but uh, we're taking this to a new level. So welcome everyone to the 16th annual Poetry Out Loud virtual competition. Students, adults, coaches, and community members, this is a very special occasion. We're incredibly proud of our students and the preparation that they've been through. I'm super excited to be a participant. And I know just to rise to this stage of competition means you're already a winner. So I'm going to sit back and enjoy ways in which you will use words to communicate your belief system, your emotions, and your thoughts around GUSD and our community. And I'm very proud of you all. The winner from this competition was Jean Duty, and the runner-up was Maria Galastian. Jean will now move on to the regional competition, which will take place in February. I like this one best. Brian he fills a quarter of the frame, stretched beside impossible legs descending from the ball of his torso. Two long arms springing from that same central sphere. He breathes here on this page. Virtual teen night out will take place this Thursday, January 28th, from 6 to 7 p.m. Let's take a look at this interview with Glendale Community Services Supervisor John Magnium to learn more information about this event. Joining me right now is City of Glendale Community um, Services Supervisor John Magnium. Thanks for coming once again. How are you doing today? I'm good, Vata. Thank you. How about yourself? I'm doing good. Thank you. So there will be another virtual teen night out that will take place this Thursday, January 28th from 6 to 7 p.m. And this this one in particular will be really um, helpful for teens. So I encourage all teens to come out for this one and sign up because you guys will get a lot of helpful information, community service opportunities, and many more. So what will be discussed um, at this teen night out that'll take place this week? Uh, thank you, Vachar. We're gonna talk about virtual teen night out, which, which has been going on since the pandemic started in May um, and how teens can come in and get volunteer hours and participate in, in the workshops and Get a better idea of what we're doing in the community and we bring in a lot of nonprofit speakers and realtors a lot of good action at the virtual teen night out we also like i mentioned have the volunteer hours they can come and get um, we're going to discuss the big resource fair we're putting together with the school district um, we're also going to talk about our case management program so we'll go into further detail of all the things that youth and family services does okay so it and why is it important for teens to join this one this virtual teen night out because you want to know what's going on and how you can participate in teen related events. You don't want to waste time um, not knowing where to go. So this will, this will be a place just like we did with the libraries the week before. We'll get a better idea of what Youth and Family Services does as a whole. Okay, perfect. So you can call 818-937-7247 or once again, if you can give your email, which is also located on the bottom of the screen, right? J-M-A-G-H-A-G-U-I-A-N at glendalca.gov. Okay. Thank you, Vatje. Thanks for coming, and hopefully you'll come back soon. I will. Thank you. Thank you. Glendale Unified School District and 23 GUSD schools have been named the 2020 to 2020 Educational Re Results Partnership ERP Honor Roll for High Achievement and Student Success. The Honor Roll program is part of a national effort to identify high-performing schools and districts that are improving student outcomes. And don't forget, you still have time to get your application submitted for our Magnet Elementary and Middle Schools and Foreign Language Academies of Glendale Flag Dual Immersions Program. You can apply at GUSCMagnetandFlag.com. The deadline for the lottery is January 
first. That's it for this week. Make sure to follow our Glendale Unified School District social media platforms. Glendale Unified School District News will continue next week.